Prince Charles has launched a new climate-inspired TV channel in a bid to capture the will and imagination of humanity. Prince Charles' new channel, named ReTV, features a direct plea from the future king to encourage the public to act now in a heartfelt address aimed at protecting the future of the planet. ReTV was launched as part of a deal with Amazon Prime just months after Prince Harry and Meghan Markle announced a £75 million deal with streaming rival Netflix. Charles hopes the project will highlight world-changing projects across the globe which can help transform business and aid in making the private sector more environmentally friendly. Speaking on the project, Prince Charles said, I've spent a lot of my lifetime trying to engage people and businesses with the issues and solutions of the climate crisis. ReTV was therefore set up with the aim of capturing the will and imagination of humanity and to champion the most inspiring solutions for sustainability from around the world. I hope that with this partnership with Amazon Prime Video we can bring these inspiring innovations and ideas to a wider audience and demonstrate together what is possible in the pursuit of a sustainable future. It is understood Charles will not be paid for his curation of the new channel. In a short statement describing the service, ReTV wrote on its website, ReTV is a showcase for inspiring innovations and ideas that point the way towards a sustainable future, curated by editor-in-chief, His Royal Highness the Prince of Wales. The launch of the Amazon Link channel follows a push by the multi-billion dollar company to meet the goals set out by the Paris Climate Agreement amid concerns over its carbon footprint. Meeting with Boris Johnson last week, Amazon Executive Chairman Jeff Bezos discussed the company's $1 billion commitment to conservation. Amazon is coming to the rescue of the Amazon, Mr. Johnson quipped. Introducing the first series on the channel, examining conservation and sustainability work, the Prince of Wales said, the finely woven tapestry of life is undoubtedly one of the greatest marvels of our universe. We must urgently reverse the exploitation of the natural world if it is to sustain us for generations to come. The time is long overdue to put nature at the center of our economic model. We have the right minds and the right technology in our hands. We know what we must do. We must now focus our effort and our actions in the same direction, in the biggest and most effective global alliance the world has ever seen. There is hope, but we've got to get our act together. And we've got to remember. The world is what sustains us.